case, I'd like to just take a minute and show you some of our new layouts um, so you know where you're going when you come in the store. And um, because we are trying to keep things smooth and we are going to, on some of the busy days, uh, going to have to um, m m control how many people can be in the store at any one time. So we are encouraging people to take advantage of rain days. And so I wanna kinda communicate some of the times that are historically slower. And so if we can get some of the customers come in on some of the historically slower times, then it'll minimize bottlenecks um, during um, when the sun's out. <laughs> Everybody waits till we're 65 degrees and sunny, and then all of a sudden come flooding in. So we're asking, please, as you start settling in, um, please stop forecasting when you want to pick up products because I understand that some of the product lines we have here, um, you like to meander. So um, try to think earlier in the morning, uh, typically first thing in the morning and the end of the day. Uh, we are still open normal hours, and so which is 8 to 6 on most days, uh, at least Monday through Friday, Saturday 8 to 5. So try to go earlier in the morning or later in the afternoon if you know you're going to want to uh, look around at products. Um, also, if you need advice, um, try to take advantage of the rain days. Uh, I know it's not fun to go out in the rain, but if you do have to come in uh, to the store itself to look for products, try to take advantage of those rainy days. It's going to be a great week for it because um, we're going to have rain on and off. So that's one way to help minimize exposure uh, to you and the staff. And, um, but I also wanted to show you the layout here at the entrance of the store because we're already getting customers um, used to just being able to walk in and turn and come to the register and we have to kind of meander around a little bit. So we want to uh, help minimize the bottleneck at the front door as you get acquainted. So let's take a peek. So here we typically have the two registers and so we've cleared off this counter here. So for small quick things, you can go right over the counter. Um, but we are expanding the thickness uh, from the cabinets. So we've put a new table there and here, um, both to protect you and the cashier to try to respect that six foot distance while still making it able to throw product up on the pay tables. So um, here, typically customers have just walked right in, gone right to the register, but we can't do that anymore. So we've barricaded this off a little bit, brought you down to all the chicks and we've marked off on the lines uh, on the floor where we encourage you to stage and wait for your turn um, to check out. And then the same thing here at the cabinet. So we will still be working two different registers, trying to help the cashiers stay apart from each other. Um, but at the same time, put a thicker countertop to help with the spacing. So we really appreciate everybody following those guidelines and um, helping us space things out and make sure everybody stays safe. I just want to thank you. Today marks 20 years in business for us and we're just thankful that we're still here. Uh, and I wanted to assure you that our intention is to stay that way. Um, our supply chain has been secured. Um, all of our core suppliers are assuring us that they are deemed essential. Um, we're on the assumption that other similar businesses to us uh, at this point, if things clamp down more in the state of Rhode Island, that um, we're deemed essential because of all the pet supplies. So I just wanted to assure you that yes, we have implement implemented some maximum purchases on some of the farm supplies, but that's really only because everybody's hoarding and it is putting some hiccups in the supply chain. Um, but we have plenty on hand, we have plenty coming, and our suppliers are saying that we are well stocked. And so um, we don't plan on going anywhere and we wanna thank you for working with us to help keep us that way. Um, we're, we're really trying hard to get through this together and um, hopefully uh, another month or two from now, we could be having more of a celebratory experience uh, marking our 20 years in business. But frankly, today, we're just thankful we're still able to be here. And so, but we do need your help. Uh, we are implementing a number of changes here at the store. Uh, again, we are encouraging everybody to do curbside pickup if need be, or if you're high risk. Um, we need to really ask you, as much as we love your business and we want your business, please do not come into the store if you have colds or fevers or any illness that you're combating. Give us a call, let us deliver the products, let us bring it out and do curbside pickup. 
Um, we need to make sure that all our customers are safe as well as our staff. And so uh, we really need you to work with us on this. And please respect the, the six foot distance. Um, some don't and we have to encourage you to abide by that. So um, also we've redone our format at the entrance of the store to um, re-channel how everybody waits in line. So please uh, abide by those and um, we'll get through this together. Thank you very much.